Hey everybody, it's Dallin with Riding Reeds, and today we're going to take a break from the Yamaha and look at a boat that's been way simpler to put together. Uh, it's the one I ran before the Yamaha. Super easy to fabricate, throw in here, and way usable. So here it is. It's the exact same hull the Yamaha is in. It's a Dragonfly 13 by 7. Uh, difference is no poly on the bottom of this one. Uh, just for weight, didn't really need it. It doesn't run dry that great, but it's a six shooter SR7XL. Mounted inside here, um, really easy rudder frame on it. We just build a square frame, uh, separate of the powered parachute. Mounted in the boat a few spots here. Put the rudder on it. Um, steering link linkage is just solid. Just loosely bolted here and double nutted to keep it on. You can see it's a push pull. Uh, works really good for it. It's single rudder, kicks this boat around fine. The rudder is a two foot by four foot and we offset it just one third to help kind of push it back or give it some power steering. As they say, the props, Ivo prop, um, really adjustable prop if you're looking for a kind of a budget option, but you don't want to spend a ton of money on different pitch blocks or trying to figure it out. The Ivo prop, adjustable right here. You just loosen the jam nut and turn the outside here. Definitely recommend this over some of the other composite props out there for a mini because it might be a little more money up front, but uh, everything else I've used, you spend more money trying to get the right pitch blocks for it. Uh, this one, you can adjust it super easy. Other than that, I'll walk around here and let you see it. Uh, pull start only. I didn't get the e-box on this, but the price of it was a little bit cheaper, so that's what we went with. And it was all together on the powered parachute, bought it used, couldn't be too picky, but it's ran great. We've had three people, gear, uh, coffins on the Great Salt Lake, and uh, it's worked really good for Liz. So I'll walk around. If you have any questions about it or want to steal some ideas or maybe recommend some ideas, drop them in the comments. And uh, my plan with this, going to go ahead and get it tuned up, get it running again, get it out on the lake so you guys can see what kind of speeds it does and how it runs out there, and uh, get some bow fishing in during the summer get the gps but yeah if you have any questions let me know there it is thanks everybody subscribe